good morning, how are you? I am. I'm Peter Sidwell, for those of you who don't know me. Um, I'm a bit of a TV chef, cookery writer, um, and owner of Simply Good Food TV. Um, which is a, basically, it's kind of a Netflix for food programming, okay? So, but it's free. Um, and what we do is we find all the best digital online content we possibly can out on the web. And we put it all in one place, okay? Um, and then if we can't find that content, we will make it. Um, so we've got some film studios, bear with me a minute. So we've got some film studios here in the Lake District where I live. Look, I'll just show you. This is where I live and work. This is our studios, these are our kitchen gardens. And this is my kind of, this is my little sanctuary if I'm honest. So I'm gonna have a coffee. I'm gonna start trying to sort of vlog every day really and kind of share some insights into food because that's what I know food is my passion food is my career uh, and my business but also the business side of it I wanted to kind of open the doors to the business world of Simply Good Food TV at the same time and kind of share my thoughts my reflections my challenges um, and my aspirations for Simply Good Food TV and how I want to grow that business to become a global platform um, for food programming because we're going to start creating new digital content. We're actually filming a new series for Amazon Prime this summer. So my TV career started on Channel 4 in the UK um, and I created a show called Lakes on a Plate with Liberty Bell Productions. Um, and it was a great show. I travelled all over the Lake District cooking. Took my kitchen out up on the fells, lakes, mountains, boats, caves, you name it. But then also cooked in the kitchen to take out to onto mountains, lakes, boats, you name it kind of thing. So the two kind of just gelled together. And it was a great format, a really enjoyable show to make. Um, and then I moved on to the next kind of set of programs and things like that and I never quite got back to making series two um, and TV and how you make programs really really changed so I decided that I would create Simply Good Food TV to allow me to create the programs I want to make and the programs that people ask me to make um, but then also all my peers all the other great TV chefs and writers and authors and bloggers uh, and, and artisans that kind of have these amazing stories to tell these amazing recipes to share and that's what Simply Good Food TV is for um, but we've now moved into this kind of new era where you can make programming for online consumption and boom goes to a global audience YouTube right here right now where we're at is such a great medium to be able to to kind of communicate and get it out there but then you know, the next layer of one after the other and Amazon and Netflix and you know all these amazing platforms that the world uses uh, to absorb content entertainment whether it's for knowledge whether it's for pleasure what it is you know it's all out there so to create a business around food and TV for me is the dream and that's what we're doing so I'm gonna be coming up here onto my little hill up in Keswick in the Lake District making an amazing coffee and sharing my thoughts and and how we're gonna do it and what's coming so if you want to know what's coming and get a little insight into my world of simply good food TV click on the subscribe button hit the notifications and you'll get these blogs now I'd love to say to you I'm gonna do them every single day and I'm gonna try but let's be honest it's not always gonna happen is it um, but I will try my damnedest to make sure that every day you get a little bit more insight now some days it might be that a product's been sent to me for review, for testing. Maybe it's a piece of equipment, maybe it's food, whatever it is. You never know what the postman's gonna bring here, but I'm gonna share that with you as well. So it's not just all the business, but it's, it's creative, it's filming, uh, how to film food, how to photograph food, how we're going to turn it into a business, how we're gonna you know, create a show, and then also, you know, behind the scenes on my series this summer, I'm gonna take you there. So like I say, if you wanna see all the behind the scenes, hit the subscribe button, click the notifications, and you will know when I'm 